Martin Van Buren did not have a first lady for a tiny amount of his presidency, and then for the rest of his presidency, Martin Van Buren's first lady was his daughter-in-law. So Martin Van Buren had been widowed long before his presidency, and his daughter-in-law, Sarah Van Buren, acted as the first lady. So Martin Van Buren, no first lady for a while, and then had his daughter-in-law fill the role. Martin Van Buren was born in 1782, so officially the first president born in the United States, because before that, they were the colonies, and the presidents before Martin Van Buren were all born in the colonies, whereas Martin Van Buren, born in the United States. And also he spoke English as a second language.